Hello, I'm Leanne Sparr. In this section, we will be discussing the Modified Accelerated Cost Recovery System of Depreciation. Specifically, we will cover the following objectives. We will understand the Modified Accelerated Cost Recovery System. We will determine the recovery period of different types of property. We will find the depreciation rate given the recovery period and recovery year. We will use the Modified Accelerated Cost Recovery System to find the amount of depreciation, and we will prepare a depreciation schedule using the Modified Accelerated Cost Recovery System. Let's begin by defining the recovery classes. The Modified Accelerated Cost Recovery System applies to all property placed in service after 1986 and has recovery classes. Three-year property is tractor units for use over the road, any racehorse that is over two years old and any other horse that is over 12 years old and qualified rent-to-own property. Five-year property is automobiles, taxis, trucks, buses, computers, and peripheral equipment, office machinery, typewriters and calculators, copiers and research equipment, breeding cattle, and dairy cattle. Seven-year property is office furniture and fixtures, as desk, files, and safes, and any property not designated by law to be in any other class. Ten-year property is vessels, barges, tugs, and similar water transportation equipment. Fifteen-year property are improvements made directly to land such as shrubbery, fences, roads, bridges, and any single-purpose agricultural or horticultural structure, and any tree or vine bearing fruits or nuts. Twenty-year property is certain farm buildings. Twenty-seven and a half year property is residential rental real estate such as rental houses, apartments, and mobile homes. Thirty-one and a half year property is non-residential rental real estate such as office building, stores, and warehouses if placed in service before May 13, 1993. And thirty-nine year property is non-residential property placed in service after May 12, 1993. Now let's find the depreciation and book value. We have a 31 and a half year property whose cost is $390,800. We want to find the book value at the end of three years and we're going to round to the nearest dollar. In order to find the amount of depreciation for this property, we're going to have to go to the table. So we look at the table for the depreciation rates we have the recovery years here from 1 down to 39, and we have the classes of properties, 3-year, 5-year, 7-year, 10-year, 15-year, 20-year, 27-and-a-half-year, 31-and-a-half-year, and 39-year. And we have a 31-and-a-half-year property. So we see that we want to depreciate this property for 3 years. So the depreciation for the first year is 1.587%. For the second year is 3.175%, and for the third year is 3.175%. So now let's use these values to depreciate this property. So the depreciation for three years will be 1.587%. Plus 3.175 percent plus 3.175 percent, which equals to 7.937 percent. So now let's find the amount of depreciation. which will be 7.937%, which is 0 0.07937 times the cost, $390,800, which gives us $31,017.80, but we are asked to round that to the nearest dollar, so that will be $31,018. So the book value at the end of three years will be the original cost less the depreciation. So the book value will be 
$390,800 less the depreciation $31,018 or $359,782. Now let's prepare a depreciation schedule. Blue Ribbon Septic purchased a storage tank for $10,980. Prepare a depreciation schedule using the modified accelerated cost recovery system method of depreciation, and this is three-year property, and we will round to the nearest dollar. We begin with a book value of $10,980. Each year, we find our depreciation amount by finding these values in our depreciation rate schedule. So our first year depreciation is 33 and one third percent times the book value, which gives us $3,660 accumulated depreciation, which brings our book value down to $7,320. The next year's depreciation is 44.45%, which gives us $4,881 depreciation, which gives us accumulated depreciation $8,541 and a book value of $2,439. Our third year is 14.81% of the cost, which gives us depreciation of $1,626, an accumulated depreciation of $10,167, and a book value comes down to $813. The fourth year's depreciation is 7.41%, or $813, and our accumulated depreciation is $10,980, and our book value is zero. And let's always remember when we're doing a depreciation schedule that the book value is the original cost less the accumulated depreciation. In this section, we have discussed the modified accelerated cost recovery system. Depreciation is a very important aspect of any business, and the modified accelerated cost recovery system is a very important method of depreciation. So now it's time for you to practice these problems.